Ah yes, spring is in the air and even though this is the longest winter in history, we do know that a lot of you are on the ropes thinking which is your next device. So, I'm Jaime Rivera, this is Pocket Now, and these are our top 5 smartphones for spring 2013. Number 5, the Nokia Lumia 920. And yes, even though this device was launched last year and it doesn't have a 1080p display, this is still the smartphone camera to beat and there are a ton of innovations included on this device that are still not included on any of the smartphones that have been launched in 2013. So if Windows Phone 8 is for you, just consider the fact that Windows Phone 9 won't be launched until the fall and we most likely won't be getting other devices until the fall. So still, Windows Phone 8, Nokia Lumia 920. That's the best match. Number four, either the Sony Xperia Z or the Sony Xperia ZL. Both devices are pretty much twins and they are beautiful, greatly designed, but the Sony Xperia Z is waterproof, glass on glass, five inches, 1080p, 13.1 megapixel camera, and it had a great review. But aside from that, we also have the ZL, which brings a five inch 1080p display on a smaller bezel, which is really interesting. Both devices are beautiful, and even though they rock specifications from last year, they're still great devices that you should consider out there. Number three, notice the combination I'm gonna make here. Either the Galaxy S4 or the Galaxy Note 2. The Note 2 is still the phablet to beat if you want S Pen functionality in a big device. Really, don't look elsewhere. Samsung is the only company that still knows how to make phablets. They pretty much invented the category. And then the Galaxy S4 is still a gorgeous device. I mean, it pretty much doesn't bring many of the iconic changes that a lot of people were waiting for, but it's still gonna sell like hotcakes, and it's still gonna bring you more bang for your buck when compared to other devices since you get expandable storage, a replaceable battery, and just about everything that people want out there. And pretty much Samsung just shows everybody how to do it in a small chassis. Number two, the iPhone 5, and you knew it was coming. Even though this device was launched last year, it is still the best iPhone out there. It's the best-selling smartphone in the world, and it's also one of the most beautifully designed phones out there with its aluminum chassis and just about everything else. It's also one of the smartphone cameras to beat, and if you're wondering why you see everybody out there owning an iPhone, there's a reason for that. So just consider that. Obviously, the iPhone 5 will be one of the best-selling smartphones until the iPhone 5S or iPhone 6 comes to town. It just happens every time. And the top number one smartphone that we'd recommend for spring 2013 is the HTC One. This is a consensus from every editor at Pocket Now, and the reason why is because it's probably one of the most beautiful things we've ever seen. Not just the phone, thing. It is gorgeously designed. HTC Sense 5 is definitely what Sense should have always been. The smartphone rocks when it comes to speed. And also, even though you're not getting the best smartphone camera out there, it's not a bad camera from the standards of almost everybody out there and for what you're going to end up using it for. So the HTC One is definitely one of the smartphones to beat this year. It may not have expandable storage. It may not have a replaceable battery. But definitely HTC shows us that they can compensate with that with other beautiful features that will just make people turn around and look at what phone you're carrying. Boom sound, whatever you're considering this phone to bring you, yes, the HTC One is probably one of the most beautiful smartphones of the year. That's it for our top five. Thank you very much for watching. I am Jaime Rivera. Please be sure to follow us on your social network of choice and give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. Thank you very much for watching.